Alright everyone, welcome back to the MX Bikes video. Today we are going to be doing something absolutely insane. As you can tell here, we are on the on the 450 horsepower RMZ, well modified to 1000 horsepower RMZ. And we're going to be ripping this thing. And our goal today, trying to go over 300 miles an hour. You heard that right, 300. I think we got this. I picked out a track and downloaded it to try to get a top speed running on this thing here. Um, we are on Freeland MX here for just a second because I want to hit a couple cool jumps before we check out the top speed. And I also want to try to get a top speed on another bike. And that is the 1000 horsepower pitter here too. So we're going to be trying to get over 300 miles an hour on both this RMZ and then the pitter edition here. So this is going to be absolutely ridiculous, you guys. What you guys are going to see is probably the fastest we have ever gone in a video in MX bike speed wise because this is gonna be absolutely ridiculous dude um <laughs> i cannot wait to try this out here dude and uh, yeah let's just hop right into this without further ado though i would like to hit one sick jump off the rip here and then we will head to the track where we're gonna get our top speed runs but i'm curious to see here if we can hit 300 miles an hour which i think we can um but the jump i did want to hit real quick you guys here because it is kind of sick you guys is check this out bro i always forget how much power this thing has it is an absolute beast here we're gonna hip this to the left right here no way Ooh. but yeah that would be insane let's see if we can't hit this though here and land it bro because you know, we've already croaked a couple times on here let's see if we can't hip this here come on we're going a little farther left than i would like oh I mean, we landed it. Shouldn't have, but we did. You guys, now let's head to the track that we're going to be getting our top speed runs on. So, you guys, we've arrived here. It looks a bit weird because we are all the way out off the map. I've set a marker out here, and I'm just going to cruise real quick, and then we'll reset back to our marker and do a run here. But this is the route I got planned. We're just going to rip straight down the edge of this here. So, yeah, we got to be a little easy on the throttle here to not lose too much traction here. And let's get our first run underway here on this thing. Um, this bike only has one gear, so it's all or nothing here. First run, we are going 230 miles an hour, 240, 260, 270. Oh, made a little mistake there on my part. That is ridiculous, dude. And if we go back to pit, it'll reset our tires, give us a fresh set of tires. That way, we'll hook up a little bit more because with this bike, you burn the tires off so damn quick, dude. <laughs> but let's give it another run here. So we hit 270, so I think we're going to be able to hit 300, you guys, on this RMZ here. I don't know about the pitter, but the big bike, I think we got the style here. So we're going about 180 right now. 190. Come on, bro. Let's hit 300, dude. we got to hit 300 here. 230, 240, 250, 260, 270. So 270 again, huh? All right. We're going to give it another run here. We hit about 275, 276, somewhere around there here. I know this bike has it to hit 300 miles an hour, bro. I know this thing does here. So let's give it another run here. Give her a little more beans off the rip here. Get up to speed a little bit quicker here. Oh my, you guys, we are moving. 240, oh, we're starting to lose traction though here. This is where we gotta be really careful on the throttle. Come on, 280, 290, 300! 300, you guys, let's see what this looks like in replay. We just hit 300 miles an hour on this bike. Oh my God, you guys, this is absolutely insane here. Uh, we're gonna try this out on the pitter as well here. Oh my God. Dude. <laughs> That's insane. We're out of there, bro. 300 miles an hour. Faster than I can fly in the replay camera. That's insane to me. Wow. So we did it. Time to hop on the pitter, dude, and see what the pitter's got in store for us. So I'm kind of curious to see how fast this pitter really is. Really, really curious to see if this pitter can hit 300 miles an hour because that would be mind-blowing, dude. Let's give it our first run here. Turn back on our uh, turn back on our speedometer. There, actually turned it off. Let's give her a first run as well, you guys. This pitter only has one gear as well here. Let's give it our first attempt here at 300 miles an hour here. Oh my god, bro! I don't know if the pitter's gonna be able to hit it. First run, by the way, you guys here on this thing. So it might take me a couple runs to get used to the pitter here. Okay, so 260 right now. 270. 290. No! Um, so 300, I think, is possible on this little pitter, dude. This is beyond me, bro. Absolutely insane here. Let's give her another run here and see if we can't hit 300 on this little beast because this is insane, bro. Oh, my God, dude. So I think 300 is definitely going to be doable here. We just got to get a good run here. Got to be careful with our traction. We're losing traction a lot right now. There we go. We're hooking up a little bit now through here. Come on. 200. 220. Oh, 240. Come on, come on. 280. 280. 
I think we just got to get a better run. It might just take a couple runs here to get this dialed here, but I think we got this all day long. Dude. Oh, what did I hit? Come on, bro. This is doable on this thing. 240. Okay, come on. No, 280s again, bro. Come on. We can do this, dude. Come on, bro. This has got to be it. Losing a little bit of rear end traction there right now. That's definitely not a good one, bro. Come on. Oh, don't loop her. That might have messed up our run right there. That little mistake. Oh, well, we made too many mistakes in fact for this run. Never know, though. Come on, let's keep it going. No, oh, come on! No! I lost 298 right now, but I think I saw 299. No, no. Bro, I know we can hit it on this thing. Come on, dude. We are so damn close, bro. This is cursed. Come on, bro. Three sixteen, dude wow we just had a really good run there you guys this thing is absolutely insane here um oh my gosh i cannot believe we just hit 316 miles an hour on this game on a pit bike nonetheless you guys i went back and hopped on the rmz but i got on a different version of the bike as you can see we're on the supermoto here as you guys can tell this is you know pavement a supermoto would obviously hook up a lot better than the dirt tire than the dirt tires like the pitter and stuff like that and this actually out here looks like it's grass but it's not you know that's why we were losing so much rear end traction so i kind of want to get a top speed run real quick on the supermoto variant of this bike here and see if we can go even faster. As you guys can tell, we are hooking up way more now. Um, oh my, yeah, look at that, dude. Oh my God, okay. This is gonna be gnarly. Obviously, the goal is to hit over 300 miles an hour yet again. I, I don't think we're gonna have any problems doing that at all, bro. But let's give her a couple of runs here, and I think we'll be definitely able to hit over 300 here. Um, I'm gonna call 315, maybe. I don't know, we'll find out here. Oh, we're topping out though, actually. 275, okay. 74 are we actually topped out want to go to the left a little bit more like i said here Got a little bit of a better run here oh yeah i think we're topped out at 270s wow you guys real quick though i didn't have to change the gearing on either of the other bikes we've already used in today's video so i'm kind of surprised the supermoto here I have to have the gearing changed to hit 300 because like i said we ran both the other bikes stock gearing and we still hit 300 plus um just kind of surprised me here since after all this supermoto and the rmz 450 the first bike we did in today's video are both I both identical in power and go back to pay or make sure we're in the right mapping it should be in power yeah we're in power uh mellowish obviously is mellow airplane mode just breaks the bike you guys want to see what happens <laughs> the bike just absolutely croaks so airplane mode is uh not gonna work there um so uh, I mean, we could probably adjust the gearing. So I went and adjusted the gearing, which I didn't have to do with the other bikes. The other bikes I ran completely stock gearing. So I'm kind of surprised that this bike needed the gearing change to probably hit 300. Now we should be able to hit 300. Uh, let's give this a shot here. Um, I don't see why we wouldn't be able to hit 300 now. Maybe even a little bit faster. Oh, yeah, bro, we're moving. <laughs> okay, so we were going 270, and we were not even close to top it out, bro. Okay, so, yeah, we could definitely hit 300 now, but I'm just kind of surprised by the fact that we actually needed to change the gearing on this and that it couldn't do it with the stock gearing. Oh, 299, I think I saw right there. Let's hit 300 on this thing real quick here. You guys, hopefully this is the run here where we hit 300 miles an hour on this RMZ here. It's got to be nice and steady on the throttle. We don't want to loop this BZ out, but we still need to get... A lot of power to the ground here to hit 300 here. Come on, bro. This is looking decent right off the rip here. 270, okay. No! Oh my god, dude, we were ripping! I think I saw 322 there. Wow, these bikes are insane, you guys. But anyways, you guys. 
I hope you guys did enjoy. If you enjoyed, drop a like. So if you guys would like to see me come in here and try to find another track that has a longer straight to try to hit 400 miles an hour, I know these bikes could do well over 400. Let me know down below. Don't forget to check out the Real Life Riding Channel below if you want some in real life riding content. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. I really do appreciate it. I'll see all you guys next video, boys. Everyone have a great rest of your day.